Yankees, not only opening a series with the Giants, but honoring some teachers, and we had them right in front of us on your left in the front, Tom Kessner, who teaches at Colonial Elementary in Plymouth Meeting. Immediately to his left, that's Patricia Hansbury of Central High School here in Philadelphia. And, and guys, I just want to say this, you were nominated by your students who wrote essays. Tom, I'll start with you. That, that has to be nice. You're doing something. These people like you. Uh, yeah, it, uh, it was actually very overwhelming. I was uh, completely shocked, completely surprised. Had no idea that she was going to write that uh, that piece, and it, uh, so I'm still kind of in shock as I'm standing here. It's great, Patricia. Uh, not only do you teach at Central High School, but apparently you're calling the game with that headset. I see. You, are you going to do a little play-by-play -play tonight? Oh, absolutely, now, absolutely. Pat <laughs> Patricia, what does it mean to you that uh, that you're being recognized by the Phillies, but again nominated by your students? I think that's what makes it most special. You know, it's one thing if a principal or an adult tells you, but when it's your own kids who see you day in and day out and they share their appreciation, it just, it's more than any paycheck, not that I'm volunteering to give up the paycheck, but it's more than any paycheck or anything else. It's why you teach. Patricia. It's absolutely why you teach. As the son of two teachers, I will tell you, you are not making enough. Uh, and <laughs> I, I do want to ask this, you, you, how many years have you been teaching, first of all? 34 years. Did you ever think of quitting? No, never. Oh, and, and, and what kind, I mean, 34 years, and let's face it, high school kids aren't always the easiest. What makes uh, you hang in there, besides that paycheck? Teenagers are great. I mean, teenagers, I think, are the best age to work with. I, I don't know, maybe I'm a teenager, you know, that never grew up, but I loved working with teenagers. All right, hand the microphone back over to Tom Kessner. We need to point out that Tom's brother, Rob Kessner, is a coordinating producer here at Comcast Sportsnet. Been here for over a decade, never been on television. You have beat him to the punch, my friend. <laughs> what do you think? You want to come over here and uh, get a little on air work? Uh, yeah, that would be great, actually. And I tell them uh, all the time that uh, teaching is kind of like what you guys do. We have to perform in front of the kids. We have to keep them entertained. We have to keep them interested in what we're doing. Yet he doesn't seem to believe me when I tell him that. So. Yeah, not only that, people are shooting spit wads at one another in our newsroom <laughs> as well. Why don't like, let's meet some of the other teachers behind you here? Let's get okay. some. Inter hey, you, you're, this is your TV job now. I want you to hold that mic out. Let everyone introduce themselves and where they teach, real quick. Hold that mic close. Hi, I'm Mary Shinsky from, Mary, I'm Mary Shinsky from Hassan Elementary. Tom, hold that mic close to him. You're the TV guy. You're supposed to be holding that microphone. I got it, I got it. They're telling me I got to hold the camera up. Penny Mossmarker, Holly Glen Elementary School in Williamstown, New Jersey. Norm Eschbach, retired teacher from Saturn Area School District. I was Jamie Moyer, shop teacher, seventh grade baseball coach. Wow. Well. That's right. Randy Wright, Robert Thomas, Pemwood High School. Tom, I want you to go back to Norm. I don't know if everyone heard it, but uh, he taught Jamie Moyer at Indian Crest Junior High, I guess was his high school baseball coach. Tell him to give us a quick story. And again, hold that microphone close to him. Quick story about Jamie Moyer you can tell us. They're uh, asking for a quick story about Jamie Moyer. He was a good athlete. I, I just told somebody the other day, he had a, he had a pretty good baseball stroke. And he you can pick people off at first. I want to know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's gone south. Ever since he left school, he has gone south. Well, again, Tom Kessner, Patricia Hansbury, everybody there, Norm Ashbach. Thank you so much for joining us. Enjoy you. your night at the ballpark. Great. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. All right. Yeah. Before the Phillies game tonight, they held their eighth annual teacher appreciation night. Students from around the area nominated their teachers with a 1500 word essay and 11 honorees were chosen and presented awards. Nearly 7,000 teachers will be in attendance. Now with more on the game, here's Post Game Plus. Phillies baseball is brought to you by Budweiser. Who thanks you for being a designated driver. And by Rico. Move your ideas forward with Rico dependability. Teachers Appreciation Night here, and a lot of teachers that were honored before the game down on the field uh, participating in the Beach Boys song there. Be true to your school. The guy in the red there is. Uh, 
taught Jamie Moyer when he was in school. And he was also honored before the game.